Hi, Killer Clay, and welcome to the video. Got a little something different for you today. I had a few items left over from Christmas, and I know it's April. Well, it's gonna be April. I'm recording this at the end of March, but by the time you see this, it'll be April. But I had a few things left over. I had a two pound Rice Krispie Treat decorate, you know, tear apart, one of those big slabs. I also had a two pound nut roll. I had some Nutella, and I had some ice cream toppings. So what do you do? You put them all together, and you make sushi out of it. Because I was told I need to eat more sushi, so. I'll show you what I did. All right, so we got a two pound Rice Krispie square and we got a, uh, got a jar of Nutella. I'm gonna what I have to do is put a little bit of Nutella down first. Fill in the voids. This could be the stickiest, hardest to chew challenge I've ever made. It's a good possibility, Mr. Pool. What do you think? Uh, I feel like it might be. It's definitely not going to be easy to get through. It might wreck your mouth. Uh -huh. I think you might be right. Might not be the most pleasant thing. I'm gonna go this two pound nut log. It came like this, it was in like this big tube. It's not like, you know, usually when you see these things, they're like individual little things in here. It's like a big one. <laughs> like a big one. Like a big one. This is also from Christmas. <laughs> so this is probably also really dry. I don't think I've ever seen anybody else actually do this before, so it's like an original. Oh dear. Yeah, that is freaking solid. What I thought was this is like solid caramel. Do. Put some s'mores mixins in this one. Mm -hmm. S'mores mixins. And then there's a uh, piece of cardboard on the back of this that may or may not also be stuck on this. Once we get it rolling, I think it'll be good. If I can get it stuck to the nut log. And then... Start to roll it. That's tearing over here. There you go. We got ourselves a like a sushi log style. You see what I'm saying? Then what we're gonna do is cut it into sections and then we'll put some more Nutella on top of it like they do with sushi. Except this isn't raw fish so it's not gross. It didn't look like it was that bad to cut. Yeah, it wasn't. Get a little cross section of that, Mr. Pool. Look at that. Now it's starting to look like something. You can't even tell me it doesn't look like sushi. All right, 
right, Tad, you saw in the previous clips there, I showed you a quick version of how I made this stuff. And like I said, it was leftovers from Christmas, like gifts and things that I found on discount after the store, walking around, be like, wow, that would make a cool video. But what I did was I took all of those items and I combined them together to come up with this. We haven't really thought of a name of it yet, for it yet, but like Rice crispy Nut Nutella Sushi. Something along that lines. Not really sure yet, but I don't know. I got it here. It's about six pounds. I'm gonna see how long it takes me to so eat it. Without further ado, the leftover Christmas gifts sushi challenge. Three, two, one. I have no idea how long this is gonna take to eat because this is chewy, 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 and more chewy, and this Nutella has already gotten cold. So these things are about the size of a softball. As you can see, they're huge. Not you get it there. Could have made things interesting and melted the nemesis bar I have upstairs on top of it. Okay, yeah, but no. The two pound nut roll alone is really hard to get through. This thing, it's the center. It's kind of like a, like a snicker without the chocolate. I don't know. It's got a nougat. What's the yellow? Is that? What's the white? Cream. Caramel cream. Like the center of a caramel cream. Mm-hmm. That's fine there. That's delicious. These centers are gonna be hard to eat. I haven't even got through one yet. I was trying to break the world record for the most big Newton Deaton in one sitting, which was 11 pounds. They were getting so dry, I decided to blend them into a milkshake. I ain't catching the blender on fire. I'll fast forward through. The rice crispy is actually really easy to eat. The center, not the much. These centers are a difficulty. Watch that. Too much. If anything, this is a good jaw workout. Strengthening my jaw.
you ask my washing machine's running because I'm not just a guy that likes to eat a lot. I'm just a normal guy that has responsibilities like laundry and dishes and house payments. Commentary <laughs> Nathan's this year as a female. You can't question anybody. You don't question? <laughs> things right here. They're good. If you love paydays, you'd love these things, but they're hard to eat. There's a lot of them. Yep. Four individual nut rolls rolled into one big one. That's how I make it. Mr. Bull's right. I feel like hazelnut spreads it. Each one of these sandwiches is like a quarter of a pound. <laughs> okay. Each one of the sandwiches is like a whole bar. Well, I have seven. It's almost a quarter of a pound a piece just in these sandwiches. Never like your Christmas stuff. You get four months old. Mr. Poole just reminded me it could be worse. We could be, we could be trying to get a thousand circus peanuts again. That was a horrible idea. I wanted to you. I hear that was a horrible idea. Hey, I said let's do 10 minutes of circus peanuts. You were like, hey, we should try to eat a thousand. <laughs> you agree to it. We end up turning it in 10 minutes. That would be awful. I gotta find the Anderson the piece with no chocolate on it.
Comment below if you know what movie that's from. Captain Insano shows no mercy. Oh, yeah, Coach, you poke me in the eye. That's where it's at. I've been eating these things for 22 minutes. I'm trying to get this last of this centers out. And the Rice Krispies go pretty quick. <laughs> you know if you eat anything in mass quantity it ruins it. No yeah, matter how much you love something. Take your favorite food in the whole world, eat like 10 pounds of it, and then tell me how you feel about it. You know what I mean? I'm good. It's like 50 McChickens. I'm like, I love McChickens. And I eat like 10 or 12 of them, and I'm like, these are awful. <laughs> and I continue on to eat 48 of them. Ugh. Well, last Thursday, we were like, ugh. Oh. Almost down to the last piece of this Comment below if you think this was a cool idea. I mean, the making of it, huh? Eating of it, that's it's hard to eat. <sighs> Finally, the last piece of thing. Next week, 100 pages. <laughs> that would be awful. Let's pull this at 100 pages. I'll tell you what, if this video gets 500 likes, Mr. Pool will eat 100 pages. <laughs> if this video gets 500 likes, I'll eat 50 Payday King Size bars. 500 likes, 50 Payday King Size. Please don't like the video. Thumbs down, my video, please. That sounds awesome. This video gets five million views. <laughs> Fifty king size babies. If it gets five million views, I'll eat five king size babies. <laughs> All right, now we got some rice crispy with some Nutella, huh? That's not so bad. People out there are all germophobic and they're eating fungus. He's not really young yet.
clean up your debris? Pick up some nuts. <laughs> Four fifty, thirty-four forty-five. Ugh. All right, so there you have it. There's my take on leftover goodies from Christmas turned into sushi. Ugh. My mouth is wrecked. Took me a little over thirty-four minutes to eat these things. Like I said, it was only like maybe six pounds, maybe. But everything was sharp and super chewy. But nonetheless, we got her done. But if you like this video, it was something a little bit different than your average. Uh, I was just trying to be a little bit creative, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like I said, get 500 likes on this video. I'll try to eat 50 king-sized payday bars. That sounds awful. But who knows? So 500 likes. Start it out. See if we can get to 500. But until next time, I don't encourage you to ever do any of the things you see on this channel. Because... Quite frankly, sometimes I even think to myself, boy, this is stupid. <laughs> but it's for the entertainment of everybody else except for the guy eating it, I guess. <laughs> but until next time, take it easy, make something cool, and have some fun, and we'll see you on the next one.